watching. Let's take a look at uh, what June is watching up in Seoul. Thank you, Kari. The Korean markets are opening lower this morning. We are seeing the Cosby down about a quarter of a percent and the Cosdaq down about one-tenth of a percent at the open. On the Cosby, though, we do have an outperformer. The pharmaceutical sector is up almost 2 percent as a whole. Uh, Hammy Pharmaceutical on, in this sector, they are up again another 9 percent after closing up by its daily limit 30 percent on Friday on the news that it's signed a license agreement with Sanofi to uh, sell their diabetes drugs uh, to them for 3.9 billion euros, so more than 4 billion U.S. dollars. This is the biggest li license deal for a Korean uh, pharmaceutical company ever, so we are seeing continued gains uh, for this name this morning. Also on the on the Cosby, in terms of the blue chips, we are seeing a pretty mixed picture with uh, names like SK Hynix lower, but Kia Motors higher. We did get the auto uh, data from the Ministry of Trade over the weekend showing that uh, sales exports were coming in very strong, especially for Kia. Kia Motors exports in the month of October were up more than 40 40% uh, coming from uh, demand for its SUVs and also its new models. Uh, so we are seeing Kia Motors really outperforming its peers, also outperforming Hyundai Motors, which is part of the same group, Hyundai Motor Group. So we are seeing uh, Kia Motors reacting to the data that we got yesterday. Uh, also, domestic sales were up 18% for October. So this is good news in that we were seeing a continued trend of import cars uh, taking, a big, taking up a big part of the Korean market. But now we are seeing ex import cars down 12% month on month and uh, domestic sales of Korean cars up 18% for the month of October. Let's check on the Korean markets at the open. Matt, over to you.